It's not enough to monitor our waterways, we need to have actions on the ground. We need to have solutions and we have to accelerate our solutions so that these solutions will be in place faster than our waterways are deteriorating. Whatever we do, our waterways do need a voice and all we need to do is listen to it a bit more. There is also the voice of the community that actually live along the waterways and they are very critical for us to listen to because they are the ones that will be affected by any interventions we put in place. One of the major challenges for Basin leaders is to reconcile the competing interests of various sectors, whether they be upstream uses, whether they be urban consumption and whether it be other uses such as uh, mining you know, resources and in particular of course um, you know, the not insignificant contribution of uh, agriculture. ITRON is a technology and services company dedicated to the use of uh, resourceful use of energy and water. So uh, we have solutions that help uh, utility companies better manage and uh, analyse their use of energy and water. Africa is a big continent, having uh, many countries, many languages, many cultures, but we are all uh, struggling for the same issue, the water issue. It is time now for Africa to get together, and when we move at the uh, international community level, we need to speak the same language. It's really important for us to be here uh, so that we can show our wares to the world water industry and also learn from others uh, about the, the innovative things that they're doing uh, in terms of research, innovation, uh, supply, other utilities. So it's been a really great experience of even learning from all the other utilities around the world. We get the contacts uh, with the market leaders. We get uh, our chance to uh, vocalize our story in papers and in, uh, in the uh, activities throughout the conference. We have the exhibition where we can show off our products. Um, and we've, we find that the combination is very good. Let's start to make experiments and then use them to think about what the solutions would be. So let's not uh, build something before we have tried it out and discussed it. Let's be more, more participative and let's engage all the end users in it. Let's try context, let's try st uh, stories because it's not only the solution or the effect of what you have been doing, but it's also that you have everybody involved.